Hey guys, welcome to Electrophone. In my previous video, I have started with signals and system and I have explained energy and power using an example. How you can find energy and power of a given signal using a set of formulas. In this video, I am gonna cover the same topic in which we find energy and power of a given signal. Like previously what I did was uh, we had a signal, we got energy. We had a signal, we calculated power. But in this case, we have one signal and for the same signal, we will calculate energy as well as power. So let's get started. We have a signal. So determine power and energy of a discrete time step signal. So, x of n is given as 8 raised to 8 u u of n. So, solution. Energy can be obtained as. So, the formula for energy is given as summation of n is minus infinity to plus infinity. x of n the whole square of x of n in joules. So the E be energy becomes summation of n raised to 0 to infinity. So it is mentioned that it's a unit step signal. So unit step signal is always from 0 to infinity. So the lower, li uh, lower limit becomes 0 and the upper limit becomes infinity. And x of n is the whole square. And we know u of n is 1. So we will just substitute e is square of 8 taking the square inside which will be 64 and summation of n is equal to 0 to infinity which will be 1. So the formula now infinite summation formula what it says when we have 0 to infinity a raised to n over here so we need to add each and every term. So since it is 0 to infinity, so my energy will be summation of there is no a term. So it will be infinity joules. That means this is not an energy signal. Because uh, when you get infinity as the answer, that means it is not an energy signal. Now, let us calculate the power. So, the power is or can be obtained as the formula for power is limit of n tends to infinity. 1 upon 2n plus 1 summation of n minus n to n x raised to n mod the whole square. So limit n tends to infinity will be 1 upon 2n plus 1 and it will be unit step signal so we'll just take 64 outside so it will be summation of n minus n 1 so let's see what we have over here we have infinite uh, finite summation formula the same n1 to n2 1 raised to n so we'll use it therefore p becomes limit n tends to infinity 64 2n plus 1 so n2 which is my n over here then comes minus n so it will be minus n and plus 1 so this will be 
okay my minus n over here is zero because it is a unit step signal so it will be zero to n so my since unit step signal you can just write it over here at this step or you can define at the formula itself but uh, only you need to do is you need to define a reason why you are taking it as 0 to n so this will be 64 2n plus 1 and this becomes 0 so this term will be n plus 1 and taking the 64 outside p is n plus 1 and 2n plus 1 now before substituting n as infinity what you will do is you will check if you substitute infinity over here and infinity over here it will become infinity by infinity so that is not right you if you are uh, well aware how to solve limits so you need to solve it by that method which is what i will do is i will just solve it i will take n common from numerator so it will be 1 plus 1 by n then I will take n common from here as well so this will be 2 plus 1 by n you can just check n then it will be n plus 1 again it will be 2n plus 1 so now substitute your limit so 1 upon infinity will be 0 and n gets cancelled so 64 1 plus 0 and this will be 2 plus 0 so it will be 64 by 2 which will be 32 therefore my power is 32 watts so as I will just write reason hence given signal is power signal now there are cases like this case this is a unique case that's the reason I have made a video on it where uh, the given signal will either have only one like in this case the energy is infinite so it is not an energy signal it is a power signal now there may be a cases where the power is infinite and you get energy so that is energy signal and then are there are some signals as well which do not have energy neither power so they are uh, there are signals so that's all about this video i hope you have understood this video if you have any doubts you can ask me in the comment section below i'll answer all of them till then like my video share it with your friends and subscribe to my channel thank you